Cap Anson at six at 34-35. And he gets a piece of this one to foul it toward the backstop. And this ball is heading for the seats down the right side as the count will move to 0 and 2 now. O2 pitch is swung on and lifted in the air out to center field. Pagan is there, and Jeter's retired for the first out of the game. Lorenzo Kane will dig in now. He had a couple of hits in yesterday's contest. Here's the first offering. There's a hot shot out to left center over the head of the shortstop. Rollins, a base hit. And with that, that'll push his hit streak to a modest six games. Albert Pujols will get his first shot here with the runner at first now and one away. Swinging a ball hit softly on the ground. The tag gets one. Throw back to second, and they've got him doubled off, and the inning is over. So a good start to the ball game there for Jared Weaver. Yankees nothing. Blue Jays coming to bat. It's Major League Baseball on the show. Coming up to the plate, the center fielder, Angel Pagan. He'll get us started in the home first. We'll jump forward in this one to the top of inning number two. Cleanup hitter Alex Rodriguez will stride in now. Back in the lineup after being limited to pinch hit duties in yesterday's ball game. Pagan is there to put this one away, so a good job of getting A-Rod on just one pitch. Alfonso Soriano will stand in, trying to keep up the hot pace as he's well over 400 here to start the year. Now a ball hit back up the middle, and my gracious, that really drilled him as it rolls toward the first baseline. And no chance to get the recovery play at first, and now we'll hold our breaths to see if he's okay. David DeJesus will stand in now, trying to duplicate his performance from yesterday when he finished four for five at the plate. Runners on the move for second. Pitch is a cold strike. The throw. And they are not going to get him as Soriano's in there at second with a stolen base. Keeping him close there at second. Now the pitch. Swing and a hard hit ball to second. Throw in time at first for route number two. Raul Abana will stand in, and boy, look at that batting average to start off the month of April. And this is fouled back and out of play. Now a swing and a softly hit ground ball, but this will get foul for strike two. And a big swing there as this is sent high and deep to left field. And I don't think this park or any other will hold that ball. That one is gone. It's a two-run shot to straight away left. Home run number five on the year. And this is now a two-to-nothing lead for the Yankees. Oh, they think they may have gotten him again. This one's hit deep to left field. And for the second time in the inning, the gopher ball will come back to bite him. It's a home run. A.J. Ellis will stand in here looking to keep the inning alive with two gone now in the top of the second. And now a ball hit fairly well here out to the deep part of left field. And McLeod will make the play, and that ends the inning. Jason Castro will step in for the first time, and as you can see, not the fastest of starts for him this first week. First pitch on its way to Jeter. Now a swing and a fly ball, medium deep, out toward Pagan in center field. 
One pitch, one away. Lorenzo Kane will stand in. A base hit his first time around. First pitch coming. Now a swing, and the barrel of the bat breaks in two that time. Third inning, already a 3-2 ball game. Swing, and he pops him up over near second. And he'll put it away now without much of a problem. Two gone now here in the third. So bases are empty here with two gone. And stepping in the former MVP, Albert Pujols. That's on the ground to short. This should end the inning. Up with it is Rollins. Throw to first will get him easily, and the side is retired. So a good inning there for Jared Weaver. His club trails, however, it's 3-2. Start it out for Toronto with Alex Rodriguez. Will stand in now to get us going here in the fourth. Alex Rodriguez. And this ball's hit in the air down the right side and out of play. 0 and 1. Line hard to center field. In there, a base hit. You want to talk about getting on top right, of a high fastball. Four. I mean, Alfonso to call this Soriano. at the letters, that'd be charitable. This thing's about neck high, but he still drives it for a base hit. Alfonso Soriano will stride in again. He singled and later scored his first time. Here's a ball swung on and lofted in the air out toward right center. There to handle it is Hart, and there's your first out. Well, he's missing many bats right now. And guys are really putting together some good swings against him so far. David DeJesus will stand in. He grounded out his first time. Swing and a ball hit hard on the ground towards second. A diving effort here as he gets a glove on it. And the recovery throw is too late, and there are two on with one away now. Raul Abanya will try things again. He hit that two-run homer his first time. And this is low, but it's corralled quickly, and both runners will have to hang on. Now a swing and a hard-hit grounder. Oh, and he comes up with it. And he'll take this to the bag himself, and there are two away now. Alex Gonzalez. We'll see if he can do it again. He homered his first time around. First pitch coming. And that swung on and fouled straight back. And a little tapper up the line, but this will wind up a foul ball. Now a swing and a bouncing ball toward the hole. And no chance on the throw. So a great effort, but that'll be scored a base hit. A.J. Ellis will get a shot here with two on and two out here in the fourth. Now a swing and a hard hit ball to short. He'll flip it over to Kiaspo for the force, and the inning is over. Nate McLeod will lead things off here in the home half of the fourth. Time to pick this one up now in the top of inning number five. Derek Jeter will stand in to start things off as this top of the batting order hasn't found a whole lot of success so far. In fact, just one hit between the one, two, three hitters combined. So apparently the table setters have not been getting their chores done. And this is going to be a foul ball. And a good spot for that pitch is it's chopped foul. Now a swing and a ball grounded to second. And the fifth inning will start with a ground out, one away. 
It's fair to say that early on, at least, the runs have come in bunches here this afternoon. A high-scoring affair thus far, and we're only in the fifth inning. Now a swing as he rifles this one into center for a base hit. And at this point, I don't think you could expect anything less than a two-hit ball game from this guy. I mean, he's been as hot as anybody lately, and he comes through again here. So a runner at first with one out now, and standing in, trouble now in the person of Albert Pujols. Hit swung on and missed the throw. Not in time as he steals second. One strike to Pujols. Now a ball lined towards center field. And that'll get down in front of Pagan for a base hit. Alex Rodriguez, the third baseman, will stand in with a run in, one out, and one on here in the inning. Now here's a ball hit hard on the ground towards short. And Rollins won't get there. It's a base hit. And they'll get it in quickly, so it's runners at first and second now with one man out. So runners at first and second here with one away. And standing in is the dangerous Alfonso Soriano. Line to left. And this is going to wind up as extra bases as Adel played one for sure and maybe a second. Here comes a Toronto skipper out toward the pitcher's mound, and it looks like that's going to do it for Jared Weaver. Your attention, please. Now pitching for the Blue Jays, number 52. Now a swing and a ground ball back up the middle, and that's through into center field. Base hit. One run scores. The throw to the plate, and not in time as the second run scores. Raul Ibanez will stand in. He homered back in the second inning of this one. Oh, hits sharply as this is pulled into right. Dives, and he hangs on for the out. Wow. Throw back to second, and they've got him doubled off in the end. Nate McLeod will stand in to lead things off here in what's now a brand new ball game. Due to time constraints, we'll pick this one up in the top of inning number six. Alex Gonzalez will stand in here hoping to duplicate what he did back in the second inning as we flash you back to take another look at his solo home run that helped get this offense rolling. And this is fought off at the plate as it's chopped foul. Now a swing and a fly ball, medium deep, out toward Pagan in center field. One down. And that's just one of the few balls that really hasn't taken the off today. And we've seen some balls really jump off the bat so far, but not there. Hit hard back up the middle, and that's in there. Base hit. So a runner at first now with one away, and in steps Derek Jeter. Here's a softly hit ball looped down towards short. Oh, a diving effort as it's off his glove, but he'll recover to get the force at second. A fantastic play. Lorenzo Kane will get another shot now, two for three in the game. Runners going. Pitch is a cold strike. The throw. Not in time, and Jeter's in there at second base. Good cutter there, and he's got him behind the eight ball now, 0-2. For Jeter, stolen base number one here in the early going. Close to the bag, it's second there, now the pitch. And this will be fouled away. Swing and a ball bounced back up the middle. 
And the off-balance throw is right there for the third out. Angel Pagan will be the batter as we get things going in the bottom of the center fielder. Albert Pujols Angel will lead it off Pagan. here in the top of inning number seven. First pitch here is popped a mile high into the air. This is way up there, but playable on the infield. Kiaspo is there, and a big sigh of relief out on the mound as Pujols is retired on just one pitch. And this isn't always the way you want to play it here. I mean, it's late in the game. Your guys are losing. Wouldn't be such a bad idea to take a pitch or two. Instead, he chases after the very first pitch, and it's an easy out. Alex Rodriguez will get another shot now. Two for three in the game. Here's the first pitch to him. Just got a piece of it as it's fouled back. Oh, he goes right with the fastball, and this is stung into the gap in right center for what should be extra bases. And he is in the second base with a double, his third hit this afternoon. And that's a big double right there, down by two. But more importantly, that's going to get the tying run to the plate. So we're going to see how they want to handle this defensively now with the open base. Alfonso Soriano will stand in now in what could be a real make-or-break situation. And you think at this point you have to get something out of this inning. The further you get into that bullpen, the tougher it's going to be to claw back from this deficit. David DeJesus will step in as the possible tying run, but just a single here could make this a one-run game. Oh, and a hearty cut there to begin the at-bat. It's nothing in one. Runners left in scoring position. One of the big keys to this ball game so far. Back up the middle, and that'll get through. It's into center, a base hit. Throw by Pagan is there. He is out at the plate. Jason Jordan. Step in now to lead off the home half of the second. Third baseman. Raul Abanya will get us going now in the top half of the eighth. And this is hit well towards the hole. And a dive by Cayaspo, but no dice. It's a base hit. Alex Gonzalez will stand in. He homered back in the second inning of this one. Neil Walker will come on to pinch hit here in a big spot. Number 18, Neil Walker. And this is fouled back and out of play. There's a drive high in the air and deep to left center field. And right off the bench, it's a home run. Your attention, please. So now a two-run shot to left center Number as it's now a one-run ball game. A.J. Ellis will be the first one to greet him as he'll start fresh here with the bases empty following the home run. Number 50, Ramon Fernando. And here's the first pitch. And this is hit down the right field line, but it's going to get out of play for strike one. Pace is empty here with nobody out. Now here's a ball hit in the air to straightaway right field. This ball's got plenty of carry to it, and it is out of here. Yorvis Medina. Is on to work as he'll take over here in the eighth. Derek Jeter will be the first one to greet him as he'll start fresh here with the bases empty following the home run. A fastball here as he'll take a look at ball one, one and oh. Now a big swing, and this is a major league pop up way up there toward the center of the diamond. Castro able to look it in, and that's a frustrating first out. Lorenzo Kane will try again. Two for four in the ballgame. To the shortstop, Rollins. On to first, and a good stretch over there is going to get him by a step for the second out. 
Albert Pujols will stand in. He popped out in his last time. Albert Pujols. And a half-hearted swing there as he tried to go the other way, and it's strike one. Yeah, he really pulled off of that one, and that's not the kind of swing we're accustomed to seeing from a guy like him. Right, especially starting off an at-bat. And nobody can get there in time. Base hit. So it's a runner at first with two men out. And set to stand in the still very imposing figure of the three-time MVP, Alex Rodriguez. Fouled straight back. Swing and a miss, and he's in control, 0-2. That thing's coming in there hot, 96 miles an hour. Oh, and he dusted him off the plate that time. Some mind games being played now. It's one and two. The ball flying around the yard in this one, as you see so far there. Look out. That one almost got away from him. Two and two now. He will definitely give you something to think about up there. There are no comfortable at-bats against this guy. And there's a fastball that's hammered the other way to deep right field. And that'll get into the right field bullpen. It's a home run. Alfonso Soriano will be the first one to greet him as he'll start fresh here with the bases empty following the home run. Swing and a miss at a first pitch changeup. Nothing in one. Now some definite signs of life in that Toronto bullpen. Both a lefty and a right-hander begin to throw. And here's a fastball that he takes the other way out to fairly deep right. Hart has to retreat to the track, but he has it to... Neil Walker will stay in the ballgame now as he comes on to play second here. Gerald Laird will lead things off here in the bottom half of inning number eight. And we'll move forward now to the top of inning number nine. David DeJesus will get us started as they look for a little insurance here in the top of the ninth. Foul toward the third base dugout, but this will get back into the seats out of play. Well hit. Deep down the right field line. Nearly a big fly to start the inning instead of foul ball. And a swing and a miss. Good pitch there for the first out here in the ninth. Raul Abanya will stand in. He homered back in the second inning of this one. Travis Hafner will move into the on-deck circle now to try to get something started here with one gone in the inning. Now a fastball, and he popped him up over toward the left side of the infield. Jordan is there to make the play, and a break there as Hafner's gone on just one pitch. Neil Walker will stand in again as we take you back now to the eighth inning, and this was a big one. The two-run shot that helped get us to where we are now. Out in front a bit as this is pulled down the line to first, but this is foul for the first strike. Oh, he looked like a caveman swing and a club on that one. It's 0-2 now. Really a good job so far by this guy out of the bullpen. Yeah, he's come in and really put his stamp on this game. Throwing a lot of strikes. That's what you want. And we'll have to leave it there as the play is made here to end. Nate McClout will stride in. Grounded out his last time through. And the Yankees offense was led in large part by this man, Alex Rodriguez. Picture perfect there. He's our top player.